Oh man. Oh jeez. Delilah. We're running right out of space here in this little house. I think it's time to move. You hear that, meat boy? I'm finally moving out of your house. You happy about that? That's what I thought. Hello and welcome back to this series that I'm doing. Still don't really know how to introduce the series very well, but welcome back anyway. And today I'm finding it a little bit hard to put away all the stuff that I found in the last episode. I don't really want to keep filling this place up with chests because that's going to get a bit redundant in the future. So Delilah girl, I think it's time we finally move out of this place. You hear me? Yeah. Okay, come with me. So before I started recording, I kind of ran around the general area a little bit just to get my bearings, see what's around. And I think I found a place that I actually really like. I'll go show you guys right now. It's really close to the village as well, so we're not that far from everyone else. And maybe in the future, one of the goals can be just to like build up this town into something that's actually, you know, good. <laughs> It is just over here, past this cursed, doomed little cave that I keep dying in, past this giant ravine that I want to explore someday. There's a lot of caves around here. I'm gonna have to explore those soon as well. Ooh, spooky. Okay, I think that's on the agenda as well. But anyway, there's also a lot of horses around here, so I can probably get a horse as well to make travel a little bit easier. And voila! I think I want to build my house right here because it's right next to the woods. I have a giant plains ahead of me that's perfect for farms and stuff and other builds. Um, I also have I also have this mountain that I really like and I really like this natural like arch loop thing which I could probably like build some stairs up here into the future and do some stuff over here maybe. Maybe I can build like a enchantment set up around here or maybe like a nether portal hub but that's way way into the future anyway so i think the first thing i want to do maybe is to maybe fill in this area a little bit more with dirt so i can have some space for the house that i want to build because this is actually quite a large house not gonna lie it's gonna take a few episodes to build it properly i probably won't build all of it on camera because that can get boring really quickly or maybe i can do a speed build Hmm. That might be an option. But anyway, the first thing I'm going to do is just to maybe somewhere out of the way, just to build a little uh, cobblestone hut thing. You know, just for protection and somewhere to put my stuff while I'm building my house. I also want to make it a little bit larger than the house I was living in before, so we don't run out of room really quickly. And let's put my door right here. Okay. Cool, cool. Then we build up the walls so we don't get shot at. Or spider doesn't climb through. Uh, Delilah, you're being a little bit troublesome. Can you just sit down, please? Thank you. Um, yes. What was I saying? Doesn't really matter. Uh, should probably also leave a space for windows, maybe? I'll put a window right there. Okay. I'm gonna have to run back to the house back and forth constantly just to get all my stuff over here. So I'll probably speed that up as well so you don't have to sit through all that. Hi, mate boy, did you miss me? Look at him, he's running away. He's climbing the mountain just to get away from me. Aww. Anyway, um, the important stuff. What do I want to bring with me? My pickaxe is dying as well, so I should probably make a new one just so I don't have to deal with it breaking on me. And, uh, da 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 da. Uh, there we go. And uh, we need the anvil. I definitely want to take my first diamond with me. Uh, this blast furnace, this regular furnace, this smoker, one of the beds. Um, probably take this whole chest with me as well. 
Oh, no, I can't fit it all. Hold on. Um, da, da, da. What don't I need? I don't really need this brown wool, and I don't really need this one plank. Okay. Back to where I want to build my house. Ooh, it is getting dark. Okay, let's hurry up. Don't want to get shot by skeletons again. Okay, never mind. Speak of the devil. Spoke too soon. Duck and weave. Okay. Goodbye. Oh my god, why do I always have such problems with skeletons? Please nothing be in here. Please be in there. Okay. We're safe. I'm just gonna... Phew. Okay. That was stressful. Uh, what do I have now? I have a furnace, blast furnace, uh, whoops, smoker, um, first diamond, anvil, this can be my chest area, and I will put my bed right here. Awesome. Now I just gotta get the rest of my stuff. Do I want to kill you? You did kind of chase me earlier. Hmm. Should I kill you? Nah. Not worth it. Congratulations, spider. You live to see another day. Okay, you know what? No, this is not what's happening. This is not gonna happen. Thank you. I should probably cover up all these pools as well, just so I don't have that happening to me constantly. And I also noticed that this terrain is really hilly and holy. Not in a good way, not in like the Jesus Christian way, but in a bad way. Wait, I'm so dumb. Why don't I just tame a horse? That would make this part a lot more faster. Okay, which horse do I want? I want a horse that can run fast and has a lot of health. Hello sir, how much health do you have? Not bad. 12 hearts, you know, could do better, could do worse. No offense, can you just let me love you? Thank you very much. Ooh, and you are quite speedy as well. Not much of a jumper though, it's quite unfortunate. Okay, we'll put you to the side, we'll put you in the good pile. Next up, we have you. Same amount of health. Just as stubborn. Come on, just love me. You love me? Nope, okay. Come on, don't have all day. There we go. Ooh, this horse is quite fast as well. Probably the same. I think these horses are like pretty much identical. I want to try out all the other horses though, just to see if there's something better. In my opinion, of course, you know. Every horse has their strengths and weakness, I guess. Were those the only horses? I swear I saw more around here somewhere. What the heck? We got some disappearing horses around here. Oh well. It just means there's less to choose from. I want the one with the white ankles. I'm not really sure what I'll name it. Maybe if someone has a suggestion of what to name the horse, then maybe we'll see. There we go. Okay, this should be a lot quicker now. Okay, I should be able to carry the rest of my stuff maybe. Uh, actually no, that was a lie. Uh, I really need to cut down some trees, really run low on wood. I'll just take the important stuff so far. Take my fishing rod, powered rails, maybe my pumpkin seeds. I can grow some pumpkins for food. Everything else I could pro- uh, Everything else I could probably leave here. 
Yeah, I think that'll do just for now. Okay. Where are you? There you are. Let us be on our way once again. One good thing about living next to a forest is that there's pretty much unlimited wood. One bad thing about living next to a forest is that there's trees everywhere and you can't see through it. So you know, it's all about take and give. Give and take, I guess. Is that how it goes? Is that how the saying goes? Give and take? Anyway, whatever. I found some more horses. I knew there were more horses around here. But I gotta drop off all my stuff first. Okay, what are the important stuff? That, 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 that. All my gems, my golden apple, my enchanted stuff. Maybe the powered rails. Um, did I seriously run out of cobblestone? Please don't make me build my house. Please don't make me build my hut out of two different materials. I don't want to be that poor. Ugh. It's fine. My house would look magnificent in compared to this. In comparison to this. Trust me. That house is amazing. By my standards anyway, I'm not really that great at building stuff. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I need to cut down some wood. God, I am just the worst at this. If I see one more flippin' skeleton, I'm going to lose my shit. Just die. No one wants you here. God. See what happens when I see a skeleton? I start to get abusive. I'm just gonna sit here and cut down some trees, you know. Pass the time, be a lumberjack. So I'll probably speed this bit up just so you don't have to watch me do it all. Okay, a full stack of oak logs. I think that'll keep us going for at least a little while. So let's go back to my house and we can craft some more chests for more storage. And I won't be running out of space anytime soon, hopefully. Uh, let's see. I don't want to turn all the logs into wooden planks just yet. Because maybe I want to use the wooden logs for a build or something. It just saves me having to cut down more trees. It's quite a hassle, really. First world problems, I know. Trust me, I'm quite well aware. Uh, let's see. I want to put some chests underneath my bed, and this can be like my special item chest. You know, my treasures that I don't want to lose. Oh my god. My bed is exposed to the outside. I gotta fix that real quick. Hold on. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I also need to make a door of some kind. Uh, I also need torches. Oh my god, there's just so much things I need to do. Let there be light. And there was light. Or something. I don't know how the Bible goes. I'm the furthest thing from a Christian. Just light up the area a little bit, just so things don't spawn around me. And should probably go to sleep as well. Should probably also, you know, finish building the actual shelter. So I don't die. Really sucks that I ran out of cobblestone. I swear I had more somewhere. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. So what am I doing exactly? I think this should be like my mob drop chest. You know, the stuff that mobs drop. You know, the stuff that I get from mobs. Okay, whatever your name is, we have to run all the way back home and get the rest of my stuff. And then that should be it. That should be the move completed. But I guess we'll see. You know, stuff never goes to plan with me. 
I also want to try out those horses as well to see if they're any better than this current one. Sounds horrible, I know. But, you know, this is Minecraft. It's not real. Okay, hopefully this is my last pit stop here. And I sh should be able to just break this and collect everything. Everything but the chest, of course. Okay. Throw out the dandelion. We actually throw out the wooden sword and stone sword. We don't need that. And that should be good. Whatever your name is, we ride. Okay, we're back here. This should be pretty much all of my stuff. So let's um, put everything where they need to be. This is like the blocks chest, the stuff that I can build structures with. Um, this can be the nature slash farming chest. This is my spoils chest. This is going to get so disorganized so quickly, I can just feel it. I also need a chest for just like random stuff. Like these rails and this paper and this stick, which I don't really have a use for. So we'll just stick that right there. And this can be the randoms chest. There we are. And I think we've done it. We finally moved to another place. Meat Boy can stop hating us now for taking over his home. Should I move Meat Boy over to my house? Nah, he's probably fine where he is. Hmm. I'll have to think about that. I uh, also should probably start building the rest of the structure. I hate to mix, like, materials like this, but at this point we don't got a choice. Oh, it is so close to being, like, Done. I just want to finish this already. Come on. We have a gaping hole for our flipping roof. We're just gonna have to plug it with oak planks. As ugly as it looks, it does work. You know, it keeps us safe. That's what a shelter is supposed to do. It doesn't have to look pretty. But there we go. Actually, no, it's not done just yet. Hold on. Uh. No. What am I doing? All over the place today. I want to make a sign. And a door. There we go. There's a door. We have a sign. Koi's shack. Ah, home sweet home. Should I say home not so sweet home? I mean, look at this. It's a bit of an eyesore, but it's functional. I should probably put, like, windows in so stuff doesn't, like, try to kill me, which they probably will, because I've died many times, far too many times at this point in the series. And there we go. I think it is finally done. I think that might be where I'm going to end this episode, so thank you for watching. Uh, next episode, I think the next thing I should probably do is probably to start a farm and maybe wrangle up some animals. So I guess tomorrow we're going to go like wildlife wrangling, so that should be fun. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!